G'day mates, something a little different today. I thought we'd mix it up and we'll go for a walk down to the beach and I'll give you an update on the ResMed AirSense 11 Bluetooth oximetry. Because I've been waiting patiently for a few months now. They've updated the firmware, but when are they gonna release the device? Now, I had been hoping, praying, wishing that whatever they choose, it would be consumer friendly. That is something you can afford, all right? I didn't want them to do what they did with the AirSense 10, which was an oximeter that was $1,000. Too much. People don't have that sort of coin. It's too expensive. And unfortunately, I think it's going to be that. If they're using the model, which I think they are, pretty certain on this one, um, you're looking at $800 US plus just to connect up and monitor your oxygen and pulse rate. Check this out, this is amazing. Hey. How good is that? And there's just no one here. But that's why I love it down here. Look at that. Hey. Absolutely perfect. Phillip Island guys, if you ever get a chance to come down here, I highly recommend you do. We've got these little penguins. We've got Seal Rock, we've got great surf beaches, and then beautiful bay beaches as well. So get down here. You'll probably see me at the North Pier Hotel having a pint or two on a Friday night, if you're ever around. Actually, I'm getting off track here. I had, for the first time ever, someone come up to me at the North Pier. I was coming down the stairs. She eyeballed me and she's, she points at me and I'm like, uh-oh, what have I done? She comes up and she's like, I know who you are, I watch you. I think her name was Claire. So Claire, if you're watching, g'day. Um, anyway, in other news, the Sleep HQ iOS beta testing is going really well. We'll finish that up in a couple of weeks and release it to the public. And um, that's it. Have a great day. Cheers.